Well, this is venting CO2, hmm. which is completely unusual for a comet. And then they say the spectrometer views of it say that it's actually made out of a uh, nuclear reactive nickel. Hmm. And if you know anything about the space and, and the way asteroids work, the majority of them are iron. Right. Then the iron, the nuclear, you know, smashing of iron is what creates nickel as a byproduct. So it's it's unusual to see an object that's actually made of nickel that doesn't have iron in it. So that's a weird a weird composition for it to have. So it was actually spotted on July 1st, hmm. but then they went back and looked, um, you know, uh, sir, sorry, the it was spotted July 1st by the Atlas Telescope in it. Chile. Um, but they went back and they looked, and they saw that actually went back to, where is it? I just lost, there it is, June 14th. They went back and looked at previous pictures, and they, basically it was in the area, and uh, they didn't see it. They didn't see they it. They didn't pick right. it up. They just so, noticed the movement of it. Yep. So they they picked it up two weeks earlier. Uh, they said it it's coming in fast. Right. Early images show the faint comma, um, and it's approaching from the Sagittarius area, more like the galactic center ish. Yeah. So it's like you would expect coming, a comma yeah, to come from. It's coming from from the, the the thicker part of space, known space, the more crowded. Let's put it that way. Yeah, yeah. The more crowded part of known space.